this is actually what they call a, uh, a live drive. So this actually bolts. This this is what the, what the main housing is. But this actually bolts into the back of the engine with this with this drive adapter here. Get that in. There we go. So that bolts into the engine. It actually bolts into part of the timing system on the back of the engine. Now this pump runs continuously. While the engine is running, this pump is running. Um, but to make that happen, there's some, there's some tricky stuff that goes on. So if you look in there, that's the actual, that's the actual drive. And that's constantly driving. And inside there, these pistons actually go into there. All right. And then this barrel also fits in. These pistons go in here. There's a special spring tensioner that goes in there. Those gears there fit onto those gears there so as that rotates that rotates but because these are actually in as it rotates it creates you know in and out pressure yeah so at one location they're actually sucking and at another location they're actually being pressed in obviously these are a bit shag so I can't really show you very well but in that position these are coming out and sucking, and in another position, down the bottom there, they're being, they're being pushed in, All right? In one position they're in, and in another position they're out. So they're creating a suction pressure. So these are the pistons removed from the bent axis piston pump. We had lots of shuddering going on, so we, we realised something wasn't going right so this is actually a set, a set of seven pistons that fit into that barrel there um, as you can see this one here doesn't have any piston rings at all this one's the piston rings are looking really sad these ones not so good either these ones look a little bit abused um, they're all a bit sad. So this was actually creating lots of pulses. So some pistons were actually creating pressure, some were not creating pressure at all. So you were having, we had a lot of shuddering, enough shuddering to actually make the entire engine and gearbox assembly vibrate quite violently. Mm.